Hi guys, it's the Monday morning and I have zero energy to do anything today. I ran out of milk, so I ordered coffee because doing anything is the last thing I want to do. Ooh, it sounds good. I think it will be better after this coffee though. I also ordered double shot. I have to get through this month. After this month, uh, hopefully things are gonna be fine. So I ordered burger, like beef burger, something like, whoa. Now I am happy. Now I'm ready to get it going. I'm an easy girl, you know? If I feel tired, I sleep. If I feel tired, I just eat or just about anything. And then I'm just back to being happy. So a few things happened. The pending things are that I'm so stressed out about my job and I always think about how suck i am at my job but the good news is my book club is getting collaboration with the comments which is like one of the biggest community space in bangkok and they were successful and i've been a fan of them for like a really long time there are two comments so if you're in bangkok you probably know there's the comments tongo and the common salading which is like an open community space they're putting forward for offline and a hobbies community and then we had a few meetings so that's what i've been up to for the past few months just talking about how the process work and how it will play out as our collaboration so that will happen from october to december and I'm actually happy about it. You might not be able to see it now because it's like, this is not new to me, but I'm just really happy just to put it out there. But since it's not new, but when it first happened, I was over the moon. I was really happy when they reached out to me. The thing that I'm excited about though is it will be, the, the next session will be in October and we just did our last session in September. So it's about to happen, like it's happening guys. And I think the moment that it will hit me again will be when they send me the open link for registration. That's I think that's when I'm gonna start to actually like freak out. But I have to send out some delivery books. I'm sending out two books and we're selling two books. So these are for my secondhand bookshop. And I feel like in my past videos, I always wrap up packages for my secondhand bookshop. It's fine. Like I'm not a hoarder. Like I buy books, I read them, I write reviews, and then I resell them. I think it's a win-win. I just resell them. Both get cheaper price than what we get from the bookstores. I only keep the books that are gifted to me or sponsored or stuff like that. I only keep some things, but yeah, I'm not a hoarder. God, where's the pen? Okay, I'm gonna try to write cute. Truth is, I've been thinking about what I want to do in my life for the long run because the thing about me is I'm very dedicated at first and I'll give it my all to just about anything to a certain point I just kind of lose interest or I don't know if it's just the fact that I've been having burnt out lately but I just feel like I'm so unmotivated to do anything and I doubt it myself like if I really like whatever I'm doing and but if I don't like the thing that I'm doing now, what is the thing that I want to do or like to do or is good at, you know? So it's like, my answer now is that I don't want to do anything. I just want to lay at home, read, watch movie, whatever, be by the beach, away from all the hustle. Yeah, so I don't know what's happening though. It's like, I just don't want to do anything. Okay, that's the two books. I am going to my friend's birthday party later today and the theme is Bridgerton Of course I'm not going to show up wearing Regency era gowns I'm dressing up as Anthony Bridgerton Here's what it feels This what my outfit looks like I'll see you Okay. Hi guys. I put on makeup only for shooting a quick reel. 
which I did. I'm so heartbroken. I'm so heartbroken by someone I don't even talk to. Like, he doesn't even know that I like him. And now I'm just sad. I'm so silly. Like, it was like I thought it was gonna be over. And then obviously these kind of guys, like, they would just pop up. And then it's the same cycle again. And like, is it exactly like how I know it's gonna be? But I just can't help feeling like, then why the f did you come back? You know what I mean? It's like, but I think I haven't properly cried for him. And today I'm so emotional. Like I was crying the whole day. I don't know why. I was crying because of the book that I was reading. I was crying because some family stuff. I was crying and then I wanted to cry for this person who doesn't even know that I'm crying for. Or maybe because it doesn't have anything to do with these things at all i'm i'm just like sad for some reason sometimes i'm just sad and today is just one of those days but life goes on tomorrow is a new day i have to go to work tomorrow get my mind off things and i have a lot of things i haven't finished at my work so i better i better should just focus on that <laughs> and then i have to go move my mom's car i've been pushing it off since like 3 p.m now i have to go do it okay well be right back of course I would forget something. I was supposed to go to move my mom's car and I forgot my mom's car key. Hey, I'm having a family dinner for my cousin graduation. And, and I'm running a bit late, so see you there. Just because it's a comfort movie. There's just like many things piled up, and I just feel a bit lonely sometimes. 